You can build a slow movie player with Adafruit's e-ink bonnet in a 7.5 inch monochrome e-ink display. With custom dithering, you can adjust it for animation or live action films. We think it's a great way to take a deeper appreciation of cinema. This project was inspired by Tom Whitwell's Slow Movie Project. Our build features a custom 3D printed enclosure designed to fit the Adafruit bonnet, a 7.5 inch ink display, and the Raspberry Pi 5. The Adafruit e-ink bonnet makes it easy to add any standard 24 flex pin connector e-ink display. It has extras like a Stemma QT I2C port and a 3 watt I2S speaker for audio playback. This project uses the CircuitPython EPD library and FFmpeg to display frames from a video file to the ink display, making a very slow movie player. The enclosure houses all of the electronics and features a back cover with slots for mounting extra components like our plug and play Stemma wired button that we have set up to safely shut down the Raspberry Pi. To set up the Pi, we'll use the Pi Imager to install Raspberry Pi OS Lite. To set up the Adafruit e-ink bonnet and install our slow movie player script, Follow our step-by-step -step tutorial on learn.adafruit.com. You can 3D print the enclosure yourself or purchase the parts from the Adafruit shop. Links will be in the description of this video. We'll use an extension ribbon cable to extend our display and place it onto the 3D printed bezel. The Raspberry Pi is secured to the back mounting bracket where the extension ribbon cable can then be connected to the Adafruit e-ink bonnet. The mounting plate gets sandwiched in between the bezel and the display's back cover. The Stemma wired button plugs into the 3-pin JST port so there's no need to solder to connect it. We hope this inspires you to check out the Adafruit e-ink bonnet for building your own Raspberry Pi e-ink project.